ZL Entertainment. Greetings, boys and girls. I'm Jack Dan from ZL Entertainment, and today we're here for day six in the game challenge I'm doing. Um, I feel like I did a lot less today than yesterday, mostly due to the fact that I did not have a good morning today. Not very good at all. Um, uh, anyways, I won't go into that. Um, I, I originally was going to work in the area that's up there on the hill, um, adding houses and all that stuff. And I did not add any houses, any more houses, but I did lay out the town grid layout, so to speak, you know, the roads. Um, well, that being said, when I looked at it, it didn't seem to be big enough, so I might have to redo it. But that'll have to be for another day and not tomorrow because tomorrow I want to get other things done. I can already tell you right now this game challenge is not going to be a win, so to speak. Uh, because all the previous two game challenges, I've always said that it's not, ju well, actually it was the last game challenge I said this, but it's not just getting, uh, all the seven day videos up during the seven day game challenge, but it's also getting the game done. Um, I mean, I'll be able to have a playable, like something, but it's, it's, it's 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 not much you can do. It's more of wandering around and being like, man, this isn't. Ugh. Anyways, um, I'm just gonna play and talk. Um, there's not much new. I added. Um, oh, look at that. That's great. Um, if we press the power button, it shouldn't do anything, but it does, because it's awesome like that. Um, let's hope this bit works. It won't make a sound, because I didn't add a sound for it. Or it won't work. That's cool. I, I thought I made it to where you could, like, you know... It would block you off and you couldn't go back the other way. But, you know, that's cool too. Anyways, but yeah, that those cars there are new. Um, this stuff isn't working, so I guess it doesn't matter if I go all the way over here to show you. But basically what it is is when you for now the only way you can get the powers that you were supposed to be able to is by like basically interacting with the animal guides but that doesn't work um because you can do this which is weird it's also supposed to be uh, an ability to teleport but um i'm thinking on taking that out because that doesn't make sense for this game, um, let's see if this one blocks off. If not, then I'll just show you the roads I made, and I'll worry about this later. Because, like last night, I'm tired once again. Now, you're supposed to pass this. Normally, you wouldn't know, but stuff is supposed to move up, but it's not working. An error, please. Okay, cool. That's kind of what I thought. Um, so, yeah. You want to see some fun stuff? I do this every once in a while in the videos. You just make them movable. That's it. That's all you got to do. I kind of thought that's what was needed, but I kind of am tired. So... Should work now. The power's not going to work. But whatever. I wonder if this will... Oh, it actually pushes me. 
Oh, uh, you know, that would be so cool if it, like, if it rammed you into the wall, it did some damage. Oh, I should have it so it does do damage to you. Oh, uh, I don't know how to do that. Oh, that looks weird. Oh, uh, normal, normally people aren't going to be, like, looking back. And I was late, well, tired. I was going to say lazy, but actually it was more tired than lazy. Um, I don't really need to do anything over there. So let's start and replay. I don't really have to retest the new thing, but the new thing, the other side. Wow. That was, yeah, way to go for tiredness, right? But yeah, like, normally when you walk past these things, you're not going to be, like, looking behind. You'll just, like, what's supposed to happen is, like, you say you walk right here, and then you hear a, and you're like, wait, what was that? And then you look behind, and you're like, what? And then you can't, you know, get past, and so you can't go back. Remember how in the last video I said I wasn't really doing much with adding random props? Well... I did this time. It looks pretty cool. Got a newspaper. This is what the game came back. Letterbox Arson Raider. I'll have to like... Oh wow, I can't even go on the... Okay, I'm gonna change the collision of that. But I'm gonna... I'm gonna see if I can change the... Um, blah, 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 the texture for the newspapers and such because that'd be cool oh and i also well maybe not here but the area up there i do know the street names so i think i have an asset for that like a mesh um oh yeah why am i going here it doesn't work but i think i have a mesh for that for this street like you know when you're on a street and there's like street signs that say what name the street is um i'm gonna see if i have something like that quickly because this is gonna be a short video yeah it's only been like seven minutes great i'm gonna have to edit that out or i can leave it in who cares i'll probably edit it out because i'm a perfectionist um so let's put um sign Static mesh, and then let's put that on the city. I kind of thought this one would have like street signs, but it's only shop signs. That's a bummer. And this is traffic signs. Um, does this have one? No. La 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 la. la. The supermarket was not what I wanted. The building was too big and didn't work out. Hmm. Alright, so there's a street sign. I'm sure I can make one easily, right? Yeah. So, I'm not going to walk all the way up there. I'm just going to zoom out. As you can see, six seems to be good, and this is what I've got so far. Like I said, it doesn't seem big. This is where the supermarket's supposed to be. But as you can see, first of all, the person who like did this asset thing um, didn't give like modular walls and such. It's just the building. And it doesn't obviously fit. So I'm thinking, oh, this may be big I pro or too small. So I might have to move like this road over by like three slots, which means I have to move all of these individual pieces over three spots. And there's actually supposed to be a river that comes down through. You can hardly see my cursor. That's supposed to come down from the mountain hills and such. And then, well, actually, it's more like this because it's right next to this. And then it kind of curves over here. 
and then it goes here, goes under here, so it'd be a bridge, and kind of curves over here, and then just kind of like goes that. And from there, I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure I'm just going to have it like go off there. Oh yeah, this is uh, what I made just for fun. See, this road right here is called Strawberry Way. So that's actually a pretty big street. That might be the biggest street. Um, this is pretty big as well. And then this one's pretty cool. This one's actually Main Street. And then these are actually alleyways, but I'm going to change the texture so it's um, this one instead. So I'll do that later, not on the camera. Not on the camera not while I'm recording uh, that's better but yeah these are uh, here like little alleyways um, and there's gonna be houses and other such things um, really small building I think that's a, a diner or something and this is the other hotel two hotels in a big city not very big though is it Although there's supposed to be a lot of stuff over in here. In fact, there's supposed to be an airport. At least that's why I'm starting to think. But uh, yeah, I, can't, I don't have stuff for that. But yeah, well, bad morning. And I didn't really get much stuff done because of it. There's not a lot of streets now that I think about it. It's supposed to be a city. It's a really small city now that I think about it. Of course, I am high up in the air, but look at all that's. Well, I mean, it's not a metropolitan area, so it's because every time I think of a city, I'm thinking of like a huge ass freaking place. Um, that's usually like a bunch of cities all next to each other. Anyways, that's all I've got for you today. Stick around for tomorrow when um, I finish the seven videos portion of the challenge but uh, the game's not gonna be finished sorry to say I am gonna try my best to get third person stuff going though first person stuff sorry tired well, yeah, I'm gonna get the first person shooter stuff going hopefully I can find a reliable tutorial and once I get that going then I feel like everything will be good and I honestly, as you can see, that's over there instead of over here. So if I really feel like it, I might move all this stuff over, which means I'll be moving this over, which means this street will no longer lead here. And this will be like a little dip thing that stops like right here. It'll be a corner thing. Or maybe that leads to a dead end. And this will move over here. If I feel like it, which means I have to redo the ramp thing. But yeah, that's pretty much, I might do that. Mm, I'll try and adding houses and such. But I really want to get the third person shooter stuff going. First person shooter stuff going. And adding in the enemies. At the very least, one. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. Love y'all. Peace to you. And as always, stay safe.